So I'm Malus Peters, I'm a senior lecturer at Manchester Metropolitan University uh, and I work on, on biosensors. So I mainly look at developing like small portable biosensors, so sensors you could take with you in order for instance to measure things in water or things in food. Uh, so that's the, the type of research we do. Oh, they're so versatile. I mean, you can detect anything from something which is really small, to so really small ions, to big bacteria, so everything in between. And obviously they're low cost. So if you want to have like a small portable sensor, you don't want to pay for it. So the cost is definitely very important as well. And the most relevant applications are when you have a lot of samples to go through, when you want to measure something really fast. So for instance, in a hospital, whether you want to look at bacteria, what type of bacteria you have, antimicrobial resistance, or potentially think of meningitis, where you really want to have an answer as soon as you can. Well, MIPS are definitely better than antibodies because they don't come from animals, so you don't source them from animals, and they're very reliable. So what you, uh, when you purchase an antibody for over a thousand pounds, sometimes you don't get the results you want. So the reproducibility is also a very important factor. Well, in the future of MIPS, I would like to see that we replace every ELISA-based assay, uh, so everything containing antibodies with MIPS, because they're so versatile, you could use them for everything.